Hi everyone, I'm Leah. I'm Trevor. We're in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And we're here to see an astrologist. I visited a psychic when I was about 12. He told me I was gonna have three kids. Don't know how that's gonna happen. <laughs> I've never like seen an actual astrologist before. What well, do you think she's gonna ask you? I don't know. I probably won't give too much information. All right, let's go inside. Ooh, if you are here for your appointment, please come in. Well, that's me, I got an appointment, babe. She got tarot cards, candles, crystals, everything you would need for a good reading. Everything you would need for a good reading. Hello, hey. I'm Trevor. Hey, Trevor. Hi. I'm Leah. Hey, Leah. My first impression of Cynthia was boom, hair, like hair, like real hair. I immediately saw that your blood sugar is low. What? Do you want the cold air on? Um, that's weird. <laughs> Wait, you can tell? Well, that's what I do. Like, how'd you know I have low blood sugar? Because then she gave me apple juice, which has like plenty of sugar in it, and I felt fine. So that tripped me out. A good psychic will become you. I feel what you feel, I think what you think, I see what you see. I'm just a mirror to what's already inside of you. This girl's legit. She's about to read my mind. My world is about to be shook. You have to be careful of stomach and digestion. Right now, she's Wait, stomach well, that's and digestion. So weird. So weird. I literally saw a doctor like the other day. You have GI stuff going on. It's like this sharp pain like in my stomach. Are you eating at night? For the past month, I've had to eat at night because I've been on set. You gotta be careful of acidic foods. Wow, like she definitely like knows what she's doing. I was excited. Astrologically, what's really interesting is that you're both in very different places right now in your life. Leah is in a more serious centered part of her life right now. It has to do with improving your talents. It has to do with how many years do I want to do this? There's something going on with your personal life also. Where do I fit and where do I belong? I feel like you never felt like you fit in your home and your family. And I feel like I want to be successful so I can help my family and I can help others. Something like really hit home for some reason. Maybe it's just because I miss my family a lot right now. But yeah, I thought that was really special. Trevor's in a whole different place. Jupiter's in, a, in Libra right now. So you're a Libra, certain planets are hitting you, and you're in a cycle where it's a money cycle. All your growth is over the next three years. Yeah. There's something about you that's gonna be very connected to England in the future. England? There's some connection that's gonna be very big for you in the future, artistically or creatively. You're gonna be in front of the scenes for now, and then you're gonna go behind the scenes later on, where you may be a manager for other people. I always tell myself that like, if it doesn't like the music thing doesn't work out, I always wanna like, It'll always work out, but you may go like from be, yeah. from front. Being an agent yeah. and a manager. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Manager. I'll manage you. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys wanna ask me some questions? Could you tell me anything about like a relationship? I do feel like you're gonna get involved with somebody else that's in the media but they seem to be somebody really well known. He's got brown hair. He does seem to have lighter eyes. How old is you, this guy? I think he's about 24. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> he's not ready for a relationship. I'm not either. Yeah, but you want one. Yeah. <laughs> but I feel the problem is there's gonna be a trust issue. There's another girl coming after him right now. Oh yeah, I'm sure there is. Yeah. Yeah. So what's this? This little chart will start getting you in touch with your own inner intuition, how you can get answers from the universe by using a pendulum. What you wanna do is you hold it kinda loose and you're gonna ask it a question. Am I going to meet the love of my life soon? In the next month? It's changing to no, hold on. In the next two months? And there it goes, see how it changes? That's so in, funny! In the next three months? <laughs> Hey. <laughs> in the next three months, I'm going to meet the love of my life. Oh, what's going? Yes. All right. What the? F okay. This is incredible. It would just start moving all by itself in a circle, and then eventually it would, it would go on the line. It would just like start moving. And I, I, I just thought that was so cool and so weird. Is my music career going to take off within the year?
it to yes. Am I going to live with Trevor? Bad, good, yes, no, bad, good, yes, no. <laughs> it's like mixed emotions over here. She's got love on her brain. <laughs> She's got Let's be love on the brain. <laughs> It says I am going to live with you. It was really cool. I was really interesting. And I'll probably do that like every single morning. Like, what should I get for breakfast? <laughs> Numerology, it's your number. What does your number mean? Leah's a five. She's very trusting. Like rose-colored glasses, positive. <laughs> and also, you're gonna feel lonely this year, which you never felt before. Like, why am I feeling lonely? You're going into a deeper part of yourself. This Trevor's a seven. A seven is kind of a loner number. This is your coming out year. Yeah! yeah! Whoa! <laughs> that was the worst high five. Okay, look at my elbow. Uh. It's a very highly creative cycle. It is travel expansion. Just did turn 18, so I am being just kind of, I, just, I have all these things I want to do. I mean, I just checked in to a hotel for the first time legally yesterday. So like, I'm kind of crazy. <laughs> Usually I don't really believe in psychics, people that can tell your future, but everything you were saying was like really spot on. In all seriousness, thank you so much. Well, thank for you for night. coming all this way. Of course, we do anything for <laughs> our homegirl, Cynthia. So we just got done with the psychic, scientist, astrologist, astrologer, clairvoyant lady. I loved every moment of it. She was spot on on everything. I feel like I have a better sense of like what I want and need right now in my life. Yeah, she was, was great. Awesome. She was really, really great. I hope you enjoyed the episode and I hope you like the next one. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to Awesome Miss TV and Leah's channel and my channel because we have super duper exciting stuff. Bye guys. Oh. To Roswell. Those are the ones that like abduct humans. They're out there. Oh, it's an actual alien in a cage. <laughs>